What's up guys, in this short tutorial I will show you how to boost your FPS and improve your overall performance when playing Splitgate. This should be quite an easy tutorial, but if you still have any questions then leave a comment and let me know. First of all, open up your file explorer and navigate to the drive on which you saved Splitgate on. Program files, Steam apps, common, Splitgate Arena Warfare, Portal Wars, binaries and finally Win64. Here. Right click the application, go to properties, compatibility and make sure to run the program in compatibility mode 4, Windows 7 and disable full screen optimizations. Don't forget to apply your changes. When this is done, search for capture in order to open up your capture settings. Here turn off the recording in the background while playing the game. Next open up the game and navigate to your settings. Here in the video tab. Set your display mode to full screen and resolution to your native monitor resolution. In case you are unable to play the game with your monitor's resolution, then lower this setting, which should make the biggest difference in improving your game's performance. Reduce your resolution scale to about 0.9. This will also depend if your lag and stuttering is caused by your CPU or GPU. In case your graphics processor is bottlenecking your performance, then lowering this setting will help a lot. Turn off VSync and set all of the other settings to medium or high, again depending on your system. Lastly, set the frame rate limit to your monitor's refresh rate, in my case that would be 60. If you want to preview your FPS and ping while playing the game, then go to the UI tab and enable these settings. Don't forget to apply your changes. Now leave the game open and open up your task manager. Here, right click the UE4 game process and select to go to details. The Portal Wars process should be highlighted. Simply right click it and set the priority to high. You can now exit out of the game and end some processes in your task manager which you don't need while playing the game. But make sure to only end those which you know won't break your operating system. Also, on the startup tab, disable some programs from starting up on system boot, like Discord or Skype for example. The last trick you can do is to open up your Nvidia control panel. You can also do the next step in the AMD driver suit. Go to Manage 3D Settings, Program Settings and select to add a program to customize. On this window, select UE4 Game and add the selected program. Set the maximum pre rendered frame setting to 1 and apply your changes. And as always, make sure that your graphics drivers and operating system is up to date to get the most out of your system. I hope this helped you out, leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.